Hello YouTube, this is Lisa. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. I'm doing great. If this is your first time visiting my channel, I would like to welcome you. And if you are a return visitor, thank you for coming back again. I'm out in the garden. Um, I was asked by this company, Fitville, um, to try out some of their um, sneakers. And they have a whole big selection of uh, sneakers and um, work shoes, clogs, uh, stuff like that. And um, they asked me to go on their website and uh, pick out a pair of uh, shoes and try them out. I went online and I picked out a pair of um, sneakers and it came came in this plastic bag and um, so this is the box they were in This is what I picked out. I wanted a um, sneaker that I can work out in the garden in, but I don't want to, that particular day I might not want to wear a boot. So I wanted some slip on like kind of sneakers. And uh, these are actually a work sneaker. And um, it's a nice looking shoe. And it, um, the thing about this company is they make a wide toe. And um, the whole sole, the whole shoe is kind of wide. And um, it, it's for comfort. And um, if you have a wide foot, then you would like this. If you have bunions I have bunions on one on both my feet so I can't stand stuff to be tight around my foot right here this has a wide is a wide shoe but it will fit to your foot so I am going to put these on and I'm gonna do a few things right here I'm not gonna be out into the big garden because we had a big rain last night and it is muddy out there so but I am going to put these on and then I'm gonna um, do a few things here in the garden and then I'll come back and let you all uh, know what I think about them so I'll be right back This fits really good. My shoe, my foot just slides in. And my bunions here, they are not affected at all. So I have a few things that I'm going to do here and I am going to try these shoes out and so I'll be right back. These our onions and um, they have gotten really tall so I am going to cut some of these 
cut well I'm gonna cut them all back some because they will not uh, stand up being this tall when I transplant them out into the garden so I'm just gonna cut these back a little bit so they don't be so top heavy I would have already transplanted these into the garden but I just didn't do it yet had so many things come up and had some lazy days and I just didn't do it yet these smell so good just a little more because they're just going to grow back okay these are the Texas Early Guano I wish you all could smell these. They smell so good. Man. This is white Creole onions. Both of these are short day onions. Okay, that's the white creole. And as I said before, doing this will not harm these at all. Because they're still growing. These are bulbing onions. And they're going to grow a big bulb. And um, they're just going to grow their greens back. 
and um, they'll be fine. This is Texas Early Grano as well. And this one is the Violet de Gami. So I'm thinking this is going to be a purple onion. So that's it. I love these shoes. These are my broccoli. And uh, I just kind of wanted to let you see how they're doing. They are, they're doing okay. And um, we had a big storm last night. Oh my goodness, it was horrible. The wind was horrible out here. And they are, um, and it had been getting hot. And that's the reason why we had the bad storm. But uh, some of these are sunburned, <laughs> and um, but they are still standing, and they are okay. So I'm happy about these. I love these imperial broccoli. They always grow well for me. I'm gonna go ahead and walk out here and take a look at the potatoes just to see if they have uh, come up yet and they have so I'm gonna hold you over here so that you can see so I'll be right back so that is a container of the um, Yukon Gold potatoes and this is another container of them they are germinating they are coming up and then that container over there there's a it is a itty bitty one right there that is germinating and then over here is the Adirac. It is a blue, I think it's a blue potato. So that is the, the what that what's in that pot there. And there's one, and there's one, and it's one over here on this side, kinda. So potatoes are germinating this is uh, garlic they're doing well
Okay, so this is my new Rajega garden bed here off of our patio. And I am going to plant some carrots in here. And um, I probably could put more um, soil in here to bring it all the way to the top. But uh, that may happen in the fall. It is plenty of soil in here. This bed is 17 inches deep. That's almost a foot and a half. So there's enough soil below for uh, carrots to grow. I'm going to put some um, bone meal because the carrots will benefit a lot from bone meal. Put plenty in there. And this is blood meal. I'm not going to do a whole lot of this. But I, I'm going to get a little bit so just gonna mix this in gonna go ahead and water this And so that's it. This is the imperator. And I'm just going to go ahead and drop some of these seeds down. And then these other two rows, I'm going to do the Autumn King. I have a sweet little subscriber over in the UK that sent me these wonderful seeds. And this is the Autumn King. And I'm going to plant these and these two rows over here. Last year she sent me a picture of her uh, wonderful carrots harvest and she had some nice carrots. Nice size. Nice looking carrots. And I had, she sent me some of these seeds, so I am going to try to grow some seed carrots like she did.
oil is already wet and I don't have to water this. If you don't water before you plant some seeds this small, then if you water after you sow them, you're taking a risk to moving the uh, seeds around or even knocking them deeper into the soil and they these seeds this small don't need to go deep at all okay so I got these packed in. So I'm going to get me some boxes to put over this so they will, uh, they need to be in the dark kind of like. So that's that. I'm going to really like these shoes. Fitville. Look how stylish that is. I really like these. I like these a lot. These are actually a work shoe. And um, it looks like a sneaker, but it's actually a work shoe. It is for those of you that uh, work in your garden or you are on your feet all day. Maybe you are a nurse, a doctor, or you know, someone that's on their feet all day long and need a comfortable pair of shoes. These are really good for that. And um, they have the wide toe so that you can, um, you know, some shoes they get narrow, they come narrow here. And then it's tight around your toes. These um, have a wide, the sole of them are wide. And, um, but right here, it just fits around. It's not tight, but it fits around your ankle nicely. And um, it just, it feels good. So the shoe won't fall off your foot. But um, those of us, <laughs> that have a um, a foot disease or a problem with your feet like bunions I have bunions I mentioned it before and um, it, it have a big wide bone that comes off of my the side of my big toe kind of like and I can't wear shoes that are tight around my foot right in this area so these shoes are great for that it has a great arch support and it is very comfortable it is really comfortable here the sole it is and it's a light shoe look how I mean it's it's really light and um, it's not heavy at all Fitville thank you for sending me these I will be leaving a discount code in the um, description box for those of you who may like to try these. I wanted um, a good um, shoe to wear in the garden when I don't want to wear my boots, you know. And today I just did a few things around in, in my patio garden and this was perfect for that. And um, my feet don't hurt now. I've been at work all day long. And um, I can tell that I have taken off <laughs> my work shoes. <laughs> and um, these are so comfortable. My foot feels better since I've been wearing these this evening. So, 
again as I said thank you Fitville for sending me these shoes I will leave a discount code in the description box uh, if you would like to get uh, order you a pair and um, these are very good comfortable shoes they sell um, I think they even have steel toe shoes they have uh, jogging sneakers they have um, if you just whatever kind of uh, exercise that you are going to be using or doing and um, you know whatever job that you may have and you're going to be on your feet all day and, and well they just slip on so easy I love these thank you Fitville so I am going to end the video here thank you all for hanging out with me this afternoon this evening and um, um, got a few things done planted some carrots uh, cut back my onions and um, just looking around seeing what all I can do and um, I appreciate you all hanging out with me today if you like the video please give me a thumbs up and hit the uh, subscribe button if you have not already and hit the notification bell so that you be notified each time I upload content so you all please stay safe stay well and I will see you in the next video bye bye